Guys, football is back tomorrow. I am excited. Let's get into these picks. All right, tomorrow night's game is Atlanta at Philadelphia. Philadelphia coming off that incredible run to win the Super Bowl. Looking to repeat. Atlanta lost to Philadelphia in the divisional round. They're looking for revenge. I'm going with Atlanta. Gut feeling. I feel like Atlanta will avenge last year's loss in the divisional round. Buffalo at Baltimore. Buffalo was celebrating when Cincinnati beat Baltimore. And that's got to be on the Ravens' mind. I'm going Baltimore. Jacksonville at the Giants. Jacksonville, one of the best defenses in the league last year. Actually, the best defense in the league last year. The Giants now have Saquon Barkley. I'm going with the Jaguars and their defense. I think they'll shut down Barkley, shut down the passes and attack, and the offense will do just enough to win the game. Tampa Bay at New Orleans. This one's an easy one for me. Going with New Orleans. Tampa Bay will be without Jameis Winston and New Orleans. They're looking to start off on the right foot after what happened last year against Minnesota. Moving on. Houston at New England. Deshaun Watson did really well against New England last year. However, going with New England again, Tom Brady is still Tom Brady. Bill Belichick is still Bill Belichick. So, I gotta give it to New England. San Francisco at Minnesota. Minnesota one game away from the Super Bowl. San Francisco won their last five games with Jimmy Garoppolo starting. I'm going with Minnesota on this because I think they have the better team than San Francisco. Tennessee at Miami. Miami, I said it. They are the biggest question mark right now. Tennessee, a playoff team last year. Going with Tennessee on this. Cincinnati at Indianapolis. Indianapolis gets Andrew Luck back. Cincinnati. They knocked Baltimore out of the playoffs last year. They were looking to get back to the playoffs and show that Marvin Lewis did deserve that extension. But I'm going with Indianapolis because Andrew Luck's going to be back and he's looking for a win. Pittsburgh at Cleveland. Everybody wants Cleveland to do well this year because they have so much talent on that team right now. But I'm still going with Pittsburgh because Ben Roethlisberger is still one of the best. Yes, they won't have Le'Veon Bell, but they still have Antonio Brown. That defense is still really good. They're going to shut down Cleveland. That's what I think. Pittsburgh's winning. KC at the Chargers. Patrick Mahomes is going to be starting his second game. The Chargers, they have Phillip Rivers. I'm going with Phillip Rivers and the Chargers on this one. Seattle at Denver. Seattle, it's another big question mark. I don't know what's going to happen because that defense has had so much turnover in the offseason. And Denver, they got Case Keenum. They drafted Bradley Chubb. I'm going with Denver and their defense and that new quarterback of theirs. Dallas at Carolina. Oh, this was so tough. It was a tie for me, so whenever there's a tie, I got to give it to the home team, so I'm going with Carolina, but I wouldn't be surprised if Elliott, Prescott, and the Cowboys end up winning this game. Washington at Arizona. Arizona, Sam Bradford. Washington, Alex Smith. Give me Alex Smith and the Redskins. I think their team's just a little bit better than Arizona is at this point. Chicago at Green Bay. Chicago. They have Khalil Mack to go home with that solid defense that they have. But I'm still going with Aaron Rodgers and the Packers on this one. The Jets at the Lions. Give me the Lions on this one. Sam Darnold is starting his first game. So it may be a little bit of a struggle early on. And finally, the Rams at the Raiders. Raiders will be without Khalil Mack because they traded him. And the Rams probably the most talented team in the league right now. Give me the Rams. Alright guys, those are my picks for this week. This is going to be a fun year.